I do not like how fast this is happening. But one day you'll understand. You'll see. All this unease will be worth something. I promise. If they'd been more open with me. If they'd shown me things. <sighs> taken me places. Maybe it would have made more sense. So yeah, welcome back. Thank you for dropping in. My name is Nate, this is Enter the Spark, and tonight I'm going to be playing more of Assassin's Creed Revelations for the very first time. It's my first time reacting to it. But yeah, I've been looking forward to this one. Last week we dived into Desmond's memories, which is very cool. Not what I was expecting because I thought Desmond's memories was going to be a recap of the previous games, but actually we're looking at his background. Like where he was from, his childhood, the Assassin's Order, what the world was like when he was growing up. All very interesting. Yeah, I think we're going to jump back into that again tonight. Might do two of Desmond's memories and then see how we get on with Ezio's story from that point forward. Wow. 43% of the way through the game. I'm saying 43%, but then that's if I'm going for 100% sync, which I am not because I am terrible. I am awful at the stealth parts. Bits where I've got to remain undetected. Yeah. I've messed up a few of them already, so there's no way I'm going to get 100%. We're probably significantly further through the game than it seems. If I'm looking at this camera, I'm looking straight at the Twitch camera. If I'm looking over here, that's because that's my YouTube camera. I've got a bit of a setup going so that I get clearer footage to do a cutout for the YouTube video. So yeah, be sure to go and check out my YouTube videos if you want to see clearer, crisper, neat over on YouTube. But yeah, thank you for joining me on this adventure. Let's jump back into it. His father cannot resist him. And those who prove loyal now may be well rewarded. Those who do not risk grim reprisals. Let's not do that. The Sultan, may he live forever. Reminds all men of healthy. Okay. Well, let's jump to Animus Island because I think, I think, oh, we are very close, very close to a Sophia memory. But no. I shall stick to my word. We shall play some Desmond memories. So, looking at these memories. One, two, three, four. Uh, still active. This one looks like we've completed it. I mean, it's probably there so we can replay it, but don't need to. Maybe another day. Okay, here we go. You sure you want to begin Desmond's journey part two training? <gasps> Are we going to see Desmond training to be an assassin? Okay, that's cool. So hyped for this. DDNA. Like DNA? What is the first? Subject 17. We're Subject 17. That makes sense. Memory sequence archived. Recalibrating Animus Idol parameters. Okay, I'm just bumping my volume up a little bit. My voice feels very croaky tonight. I have to do a lot of talking in my job. I think I've burnt my throat out a little bit today. Okay, okay. Toggle shape. Oh, that's right. We've got like... Someone's ringing the bells. It's like Sunday school bells, but I'm guessing for assassins. Like it's time for our lessons. The morning bell. God, I hated that. <laughs> Ringing five days a week just before dawn. Up before the birds, 
Me and the other kids. Come on, Desmond, get up. No lagging. Exercise. Mandatory. A dip in the creek to get clean, then oats with butter and apple juice for breakfast. Ugh. That sounds pretty good. Oats for apple. I hope it's an apple juice. Um, I'm not getting anywhere with this. It pushes the blocks back, doesn't it? Look at that. Cool, so I can delete some of the previous ones. So what, I've got to find a way up or down? We used to have a, um, like a, I guess you called it a recess bell at my primary school when I was a kid. And you used to, uh, you used to have like a rotor for who would get to ring it because they'd let the kids ring it sometimes. Okay, my theory did not pan out. I wondered if maybe the block would stop it, but it does not. Right, there is no way I'm getting past any of this, so I'm going to have to drop down, I think. Oof, probably didn't need to drop that far down. So basically, I'm not allowed to build anything in this weird-looking square. Or I've got to be really, really quick, like Fortnite builds. Ah, it is as well. I've just got to be really quick. Let's go up here. Let's get that one there. So I built some stairs. Nice, we did it. This one, I'm literally. Yeah, that did not work. There we go. Going up. See, I'm too, I'm too big brain for these. I must have walked a million miles before I was ten. But it was nice. I like those days out in the hills. The hush, the open air, the deep dark of the forest. The crunch of boots on the dry ground. Can you see Rapid City from here? No, no. That's much further east. Did he say Rabbit City or Rivet City? Because I'm also playing Fallout 3 at the moment. I'm picking up the picking up on Rivet City. I imagine he said Rabbit City. Oh wow. That's pretty. Um, am I seeing Washington? No. Mount Rushmore. I live in the UK, okay, so I'm not too familiar with these landmarks, but I'm pretty sure that's Mount Rushmore. It's the um, faces of the... I'm going to make a fool of myself now. I'm going to say presidents. Are they founding fathers? I don't know that much about US presidencies. I like what Ezio said about growing up in that kind of a rural setting. I grew up in a very rural place myself. Um, and yeah, absolutely loved it. Oh, no, 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 no. That made me feel ill. <laughs> right, let's try that again. There we go. Let's put that one down. Oh man. Okay. We've got to climb, got to get over these. Mustn't touch them. Mm, 
not happy about that. Needs to go higher. Does that have... Yeah, look at that. There's like a big chunky one there that will come down and get us. I need to... There's no way. Like, that one is the ceiling one. That one's coming down. Won't get past it. So maybe after this one. I wonder if it's like high pollen count or something that's made me feel... Oh, blah. Excellent. Ooh, that was close. Let's not do that. Is there a way to, like, delete all of them? Okay, just the last one I put. I don't know why I'm making these bridges. I don't really need them right now. Now, what is this? It sounds like a cat purring. Only when I put stuff in it. Does it... Oh, it destroys it. Okay. So, I... I can walk in them. Just can't... Build in them. <clears throat> Let's go up here. Get a better vantage point of what's down there. This is really reminding me of um, Portal and Cubed. I'm saying Cubed, it's not Cubed, it's Cube. Just the one. Just a cube. And then there's Cube 2, which is a very different game. Ah, I know what I have to do here. I have to fall through that red zone and then place a block at the very bottom to save myself. It's going to hurt though, that's quite a fall. There's definitely not like a gap anywhere. No, they've definitely filled in every inch of it. I could keep climbing and see what's up there. I'm going to do that. Let's be very silly. I'm sorry about this. If it's If it's pointless, it's, you know, at least we know, but it will bother me if I don't have a look up here. Building a stairway to heaven. Okay. Nope. Okay. Didn't like my stairway. I'm curious how far can I... I can fall quite far on these. They kind of break my fall. Okay. We can do this. We can do this. I'm sitting a million miles away from my camera and I've just noticed my HD camera's falling backwards. No. Must have knocked the table. There we go. Look at that. Lighting's all better. You can see my beautiful face. Let's do this. Here we go. Not too far either. I thought it was going to be a shorter gap to like have to jump into, but nope. This one's going to make me float up, and I actually want to go down. It's Nah, it's not that big of a deal. Oh wait, no, this one's going down. It's not touched the ground at all. <gasps> Can you hear that? Where's that coming from? Is it those things? I think it is, isn't it? Maybe these just sound sparkly. I don't think I'm going high enough, quick enough. Oh, I am. Hey, there we go. Easy. Right, let's get above. I have to get whatever that thing is over there. I have a feeling, I think I missed one in the first memory. So I don't think it really matters whether I get those or not for this point forward, because I bet it's like 100%. You have to get all of them unlock whatever it is that unlocks. What is this war about? What are we fighting for? They never it's told me much. realistic Just enough. They kept things shrouded. An air of secrecy. For my own good, they said. So we stayed hidden. Away in the Black Hills. 
If anyone ever knew who we were, or what we were doing, there'd be trouble. They're everywhere, Desmond. They have their hands in everything. Politics, war, finance, high-tech, agriculture. People are asleep, and while they dream, Abstergo builds a nightmare. Abstergo. The first time I saw that name, it was on the side of a bottle of ibuprofen. <clears throat> Mom laughed when I asked her about it. Can't get away, she said. Well, we pick our battles, I guess. So many to choose from. She told me the average American household contains three dozen Abstergo-owned products at any given moment. Damn. If you tried to purge them from your life completely, it would be a full-time job. Wow, okay, so Abstergo is big money. Like, it really has taken over everything. That's kind of scary, because we've got some real-world comparisons as well, you know? There are some pretty big corporations out there that are... Even if it's not obvious that the name's involved, like, they could be behind it. I think, even things like Google, um, it's got more connections than we know. It's not just, you know, internet basis. It's, there's, so, there's so many sort of aspects and divisions and branches within these big corporations that it's kind of scary that they have that much influence in our lives. So yeah, Abstergo. Everything from ibuprofen to household products. Um, what is happening? Where am I going? I'm going up and I'm going across. I don't like how that's a red zone. Um, I'm going to need to build something as soon as I get into this. Okay, we're safe. Top corner, but I actually want to go that way. Ooh. Nope, we're going to commit. So Desmond's... Oh, I've just seen what's to my right. Don't like that. Ooh, okay. Okay, okay. So this was it. Breathe. The global conspiracy, Abstergo. Fingers in every pie. Governments, corporations, universities. Mom and Dad made it sound so scary. But it didn't feel scary. An enemy has to have a face, but all I could see was a bottle of painkillers. So yeah, Desmond's mum was an assassin. I mean, his whole family was, so it must be like a genetic thing then you're born. Um, obviously it's genetic because Ezio's his ancestor, Altier's his ancestor. But, yeah, he's born into it. The creed. I like this red one, it sounds like a purring cat. I go down, I think I go down there, and this is going to get very complicated, because if I go up, it's going to push me into that wall, which will get me nowhere, unless I need to get to the back corner, but no, it's all red over there. Let me have a look. I've got a... I do have to get up there. I have to navigate around all this. Okay. I think I know what to do. I need to go up to the back, drop down, and save myself in that section over there. I'm looking straight ahead up. But I've got to be careful of these pillars. Do 
do this. Let's be very careful. Is there someone else in here? Just heard knocking. I want to head that way. So get up here. Ooh, I don't like the sound of that. Let's go this way. Let's go down. That was fast pace. Okay. Let's pay attention to this one. Did they change direction? And they change at random. Okay. Gotta not panic. Just get above this one. There we go. <laughs> cool. It's like keep your nerve on that one. What scared me was the training. Sweat, tears, bloody lip every once in a while. Focus, Desmond, focus. How far were they going to push me? Strength, speed, agility. No excuses. Couldn't stand it. What was the point? For years and years, I thought some major catastrophe was on the horizon. Oh, I didn't wow. know what to expect. Yeah, there it is. So that's what that sound is. It is a shiny thing I've got to collect. Wow, look at these silhouettes as well. The training, fencing, running. Basically training, like it's like military training, isn't it? What he's had to go through. It's crazy. Oh man, this is happening way too fast. Ooh, I do not like how fast this is happening. It gives me no time to prepare myself. I just need to have a moment to breathe. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, we're going down, we're going down, we're going down fast. We need to head this way. So this is the speed and agility thing that he's talking about. One day you'll understand. You'll see all oh. this unease will be worth something. I promise. If they'd been more open with me. If they'd shown me things. <sighs> taken me places. Maybe it would have made more sense. That's quite cool. Making a gamer experience like hearing William or Bill whatever his name is say to me this unease it's gonna be worth it you know one day you're gonna understand it and I'm here I am literally dodging stressing yeah very cool I like it so Istanbul this seems too simple is this the end is that training over was that the ending I think it was Not seeing anything else anywhere else let's go this way Oh, that's trippy. Okay. There was something at the end of that tunnel. Interesting. Very interesting. I'm going to have some tea. Failed to reinitialize. Archive access terminated. Resetting the avatar. 
Okay. So, since a child, Desmond's been preparing for the apocalypse. She's been preparing for the end of the world, at the hands of the Templar, or Abstergo. And he's resented every minute of it. But that training is what's probably keeping him alive now. Saved his life from Abstergo once, twice already. Who knows, maybe it's helping him survive whatever this is. I really do wonder if we're going to play as Desmond in... Like, I keep thinking, are we going to play as Desmond in Assassin's Creed 3? I don't want any spoilers. I want to find out for myself, but that's... It's a hunch of mine that we're going to... I feel like this, is a, this can't be the end of his story. Oh, I just don't know. I really don't know. Desmond's Journey Part 3, Escape. Oh man, this is going to require some quick reflexes, isn't it? Sleeps up. It's quite cold here, but I'm, I don't know, I'm just uncomfortable wearing a jumper. sequence archived. Recalibrating Animus idle parameters. Okie dokie. Desmond's Journey Part 3. Let's do this. Oh, I like that. It's like a bit of a beat to it. I wanted out. I wanted my own life. To live my own way. That's interesting as well. People who tend to grow up in these sort of orders. You do. And ultimately I think it's really important that you do have the choice for yourself. To decide if you that's something you want to be a part of. But you also have to recognise that generally generally your parents have your best interest at heart. And generally the traditions that we have are tried and tested ways that have been built up over generations to keep us safe and to enable us to have the best lives that we can. But I also think it's really important to improve upon those traditions, to not get stagnant and think those are the only ways that things can be done. That yes, that should be our base threshold, our minimum level, and then we should have the freedom to, one, choose whether or not we want to even apply that, and two, the freedom to shape it into something that will be of more use to us. So I think, like Desmond's saying, that he just wanted out. He's realising now, you know, there's this subtlety there that what he's really saying is if only he paid more more attention but he's also not denying the fact that yeah it was hard it was really hard for him to be an assassin to grow up in that kind of way but he now sees the value of it and I think yeah there's a good lesson in there for all of us that and this is these are just my observations I could be completely wrong what do I know but what I've personally experienced. It's not as clear cut of do or don't. I can hear a shiny. Was it up there maybe? See, this is why I love video games, because they spark that kind of they get us thinking. It's about that inspiration for us. 
and you can make something that's fun to play, that is relaxing, good for the mind. There's just a bit of fun, there's just a bit of storytelling. And then you can apply this sort of sub-layer of meaning and message you want to get across. And I think it's really cool. There's some pretty cool games out there um, that do that really well of like meaning behind life and things. And I don't think Assassin's Creed sets out to be that kind of a game, but yeah, no, it it's it still has some pretty good ah uh, some pretty good messages behind it. Right, I'm gonna try and climb this. For a game that's about murdering people. <laughs> Literally assassins. It's um it can be deeper than we think. Can you see that over there? That looks like Do you remember in Brotherhood you had the Oh, there's no way through here. Oh, I do know what that is. Yeah, we've seen that already in this. I was going to say, it looks like the Subject 16 or whatever it was, his memories in Brotherhood. Her and Cat. Alright, let's drop down to the parent Cat. I don't know why I'm doing it like this. There we go. Escape. So is this going to be Desmond's escape from the Order? Bet it is. Uh, I've just realised what I need to do, and I've come all the way down. Let's go up. Let's go up. Let's go up. Let's go across. Let's see, you got to do this. You got to like hop your way across a little bit. Mm, no. Need to be higher. to that. And then I gotta just hop over onto this beam. There's nothing. Damn it. That was like a groundhog day moment. Like your nightmares when you fall fall into the abyss. So, how am I going to clear that gap? Because I'm already in the gap, I can run across it, maybe. Spare myself pain of broken legs. Come on then. Sixteen years old. And where was I going? No idea. Just away. That's it. That was the plan. Not much of one. Sixteen's very young as well to run away. They never guessed what I was doing. Because I didn't know what I was doing. I just walked right out. Someone realized I was gone. They shouted. I started running. Desmond! Desmond! It sounds like, um, William. It sounds like Bill. So was Bill his father or his tutor or something? Was he like Al Muallim 2.0? I'm very aware that that is getting close. Climb. Let's 
way. This way. This way. Oh, just can't quite get under. Um, I might be in trouble here. There we go. Frustrating. All that progress, I fell straight back to the floor because of my hubris. I think I could delete the floor below me. Come on. Come on. No. Uh oh. Yep. <laughs> ah, this is so annoying. Okay. I think it'd be relatively simple what to do. No, that ceiling catches you out too early. There we go, I might have cleared it this time. And then back that way, back that way. There. That's what I wanted to do. I want to get past this thing with its ones and zeros. It's binary code. And I want to get down there somehow. Let's see how far this side it comes. Oh, I just realised I didn't even need to come up here, did I? I just need to get to that platform down there. I'm too smart, too perceptive. Right, it's down there. Not a lot from the looks of it. I wonder why they went for a first person view on this part. It was for this it sort just of thing. ran and ran and ran. All that training was finally worth something. <laughs> oh, come on. Seriously. What? How am I meant to figure this out? Let's say just book it down the middle. Oh, I am. I'm literally just going to run, aren't I? I've just got to be as fast as I can. Run. It's going to come back the other way. I don't really want to be chased by it. I want to follow it. Okay, here we go. Any second now. Let's go. God, it was so dark when I left. <gasps> the forest. No! Endless. I didn't dare take the roads. Okay. Ooh, okay, we can actually just get through this. It's not too bad. Desmond, where are you? Mother. I'm calling out. Oh, I can't get above this thing. Stay. Man, I've got to get above this thing. Okay. No, you don't. I no, you don't. Hills down, down until I hit a stream. I followed that to a river, and from the river to an old access road. This is cool. Oh, we're actually moving. Okay. Don't don't really want to be this high up. I want to be lower down. I don't want to be pushed into a wall. So I do actually have to run. Okay, that's cool. the old ones. So what's down there then? Kind of want a tea break, but I think I need to just keep going. Uh, I'm getting pushed into a wall. I imagine this is quite disorientating just to watch. Oh, this is too high. 
higher. Ooh, this is too close. Too close! Fell right into that one. 